So when you start up your uh, Kumu link, you'll find this big mess of node and networks. And what we're going to do in this video is just give you a very quick introduction on how to make sense of all of this uh, info. So if we click on our Outcomes button at the bottom, and then on the Zoom to Fit button here, it'll give us a, a quick overview of the SLDM project itself. So here if you click on the project, you can see a little bit of information about SLDM and again if we click on these outcomes we can find out a little bit about each of those outcome themes. Let's drive in to get a little bit more detail so we can then click on the uh, activities that are associated with each of those outcomes. So we can see we've got a range of different activities here so it's got outcome 2G, outcome 2E which is uh, the LiDAR uh, element, outcome 2B is the um, uh, the delivery of and the construction of uh, infrastructure uh, for GLSC uh, outcome 1A, which is a policy paper. So uh, we can see here that you know the issues that that policy paper is hoping to address, the associated GGI activity number, whether it's been mainstreamed or not, what it's part of, and the solutions that it's provide. We can also drill down into the specific deliverables that have been associated with each thing. So while we're on outcome 1A, why don't we have a look at policy 2021, which is the draft national land use policy. So we can see information about what's been collected as part of each of those deliverables and where they exist uh, within our network. And so through this way, we can start to see, you know, just that little uh, insight into the uh, outcomes, the associated activities to achieve those outcomes, and the project deliverables which are supporting the, the delivery of those activities themselves.